Whew. Previously on Division, we just came here to board on this plane and we tried to board, it's explored from the nowhere, I don't know what just happened. And this made me, you know, concussed and blurry vision, all the flames are going all the place. And again, I opened the eyes. That squarey little zombie face scared me because it's an apocalyptic world and all the zombies are scrolling. But in the midst of the thing, there was a new chopper there. It was a news chopper and they bring me they bring me in and we just flying over the place and she was trying to do something weird things i don't know what is there going on anyways slave it and she what what the hell is she doing with me okay she just injected some kind of drag or something like that that instantly made me good and show that freaking gas mask is tear up all the place and she's explained the situation all the place you know the commander is dead and we are the only ones left no one's the command you have to do everything to do a lot of jobs to do and at the time the pilot just say see it's a nice view of cities burning up the fire and zombies are crawling up and the intro is coming up And here comes the sad truth. We are the only yeah. two division yeah. agents left to, you know, handle this freaking zombie apocalyptic thing, you know, because we are the elite group of soldiers who is responsible for taking every action in this place. And here comes the allies. And when I get down, I see some freaking, you know, papers all over the place. And she's on a total wreck, so she's out of commission. Yeah, that's a good news. We have a captain in there, and she's also lost, so we have to do everything. Yeah, 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 definitely. I have to do everything because you are a total rook. Okay. Then I just. Then the reality hits. I have a lot of weapons, you know, to upgrade and all those things. But I never know that I didn't have the parts for to upgrade all those things. I have to find everything by exploring the world and getting those things and you know upgrade all those things so that I can fight with the freaking huge level zombies. And I saw these guys are uh, pulling up the structures over there. I just asked them for a ride to the bath bigger. You know, get back to the base, and I really tried to beg a lot, but they didn't even listen to me because they are NPCs. They don't even care about me in walking to the base because I'm a division agent. They didn't care about that. I tried to board on this uh, stretcher uh, forcefully, but they didn't even, you know, they didn't even mind me. They just, they just, they just fucking look at me like a literal NPC, and I just run to these freaking guys over to try to talk, but. They don't even want to talk to me. I don't. I, what the fuck, man? I'm a really man over here, or I'm invisible to these guys. So finally, we reached this freaking notice board that just updated my game uh, map and showed me all of those things are happening in the map. So we can choose from a wide variety of missions, side missions, encounters. All of those things are happening around, but I didn't really understand them because. I'm a noob and I don't know how these things are working out, you know, and I just tried to figure out which one to choose to play and all those things, but I found a simple one with the enemy level 3 when I was going all the to the place, I encountered with this freaking stupid idiot guys, it's robbing a corpse and they tried to shoot me, I didn't leave them because they tried to shoot me and I tried to kill him because my aim was too bad, I, it's take me uh, quite a bit of time to kill those guys, you know. Then I just move on and I found something really terrible because these guys are walking oh right over there. God. I didn't like those guys. I just killed them with an easy peasy thing. And he's a ritual bot, so I just killed him easy with my fist. That's literally happy for me. Then I just tried to move on to the main mission. So we just encountered this sewer. This is where we have to go. And he's jumping. 
And it was not easy to go over there because it was literally scary because we have alligators on sewers that but I know about from videos. I don't know how this is was working out anyways. So we we'll just, just moved on and finally I reached a place. I heard some freaking voices over here. And yeah, I pretty much I'm sure that there is a lot of enemies over there. I don't know how much are there, how which levels are over there. Is it going to be easy? I have no info. I just blindly go in. I just saw two guys are working on a valve. I just shoot the gas canister of first guy and second guy is running away. And another guy, third one is hiding behind the blocks over there. Uh, I tried to shoot the third guy, but the second guy didn't leave me. You know, I just have to try to cover off this wooden plank over here and try to shoot this guy down. I just almost killed him, but the other guy tries to also shoot me. It was true. Literally a tight post spot for me, and I tried to shoot and you know blew up his canister and I just fried him. I just jumped down, go for this valve over here. It's actually for a water supply thing. That was my you know Morning. idea, but and just you know automated sound just said me water pressure is critical warning. and Our warning there is horses are approaching. Fuck yeah, I just completed a mission almost and this there is hostage and hostiles and I didn't see anybody. They just sent me hostiles and this random guy spawned from nowhere and tried to shoot me. The first bullet that I get shot from was different direction, the second guy is from the other direction and this guy from the top of the ramp is literally obliterated me to the brink of death and just survived. And again, hostile forces are approaching. The valve is on the top. We have to go to find the top. And the valve is jammed. We have to spin the valve to come in this mission. And I was on the top, trying to get some cover. And the three guys stationed downstairs and literally aiming me because I saw a guy over here. I have to aim for the three. This was too hard, man. But I really tried. I, uh, here and there, I have to try to reload. I have to shoot the guys. I have to. You know, make my health priority. And I blew up his first one's canister and dead. And I tried to shoot the second guy, almost kill. It's a one one shot. And I just run away. I don't know why. And this guy was too far away to easy to kill me. So I just killed him. And I don't know why this guy always running all over the place because he has easy to kill. He can easily kill me with a shot or this fire extinguisher or fire flamey thing, whatever he has. He can just kill me with a thing so easily. But he didn't do that. I don't know why he didn't do that. And I tried to, you know, spin this valve so that I can reduce the pressure of the water in the pipes so this thing we don't blow up. Morning. And Hostile again, there is it. The horses are approaching. I have to go and fight these guys with a huge gas canister behind and they just only shoot me with a freaking gun. And this guy with a freaking shield and a, and a hammer just blindly rushed onto me. I don't know what he's thinking about. He's literally brainless or maybe and this guy is hiding over there he, he thinks he can escape from me but he doesn't know me <laughs> I just killed him with this and I later found out that he was a grenadier so he has to get the cover and his grenade almost took me out and this guy's gunfire also took me out and that time he surprised me with his freaking flamethrower and I just killed him easy peasy and the last valve there is a last valve over here. We have to do it. We have to do it. And pressure is on hit critical level. And there is more enemies is coming up. And again, this guy with the hammer and shield. Another guy with the nade. Okay, this guy's the nade one. Okay, I found out. And we have to finish it up. Once he started spinning the valve, this guy just came in and tried to, you know, fry me with his flamethrower. But unfortunately for him, I just blew up his tank and he just died. <laughs> And again, these guys are from nowhere trying to shoot me. I just take out of this freaking pipe. And there is three, four, I don't know. Yeah, four guys over there. And I just try to shoot multiple of them and almost kill me. They almost kill me. So I have to get the cover. I'm struggling to get the cover so I can heal. But I didn't have a heal. I just realized that right now. I have to wait for the auto recover to this level. And. To aim better, I have to find these guys off guard and just kill one guy. The other, you know, they just trying to kill me. I don't know why this 
provide the forward with these NPCs. They are literally so good with shooting people down. I just took two down, and there's a main guy is coming on the front right. I think he's the boss of this particular mission. I don't know. And I almost killed him and just one HP. And you know, come on, boy, show your fucking face. I told him, and he just showed me. I just killed him. Boom, done. We just come into the encounter and just running back to the base all the way. And on the way, I saw this puppy, the the new agent for division, and he just barked me and just killed him. <laughs> He's a PC. Poor guy. He doesn't have to die, but you know, he just barked at me, and I thought he was a real offender. And this is where the real mission starts up. Not the real mission. This was a side quest, anyways. And this guy with the baseball bat is really badass, and he tried to kill me with his baseball bat and almost, almost killed me. And there was another guy with the SMG or something. He's trying to kill me and I almost killed him with the one HP, literal one HP, man. And that was toward the end because I found out that these guys have a lot of friends in this freaky cheeky neighborhood. And I was uh, pursuing those guys with the intuition and encounter these two as talking around here. I tried to kill one guy, but unfortunately I couldn't kill the first guy. Yes, I should he just run away. I just killed the second guy, and I just killed the tried to kill the first guy, and he just obliterated with me his freaking gun. And then I returned back. I found out these guys over here. They are the friends of the first guy in the encounter, and I just took my revenge. I killed the two instantly and just pursued for the third one on a flank and he just throw me in there but this, this aim was too bad that's why I killed him in easy way to flank and just surprised him with a gun and then I don't know where the fuck they just got the shot from so I was confused I got a shot I was confused I was trying to find him and I didn't see him you know I didn't see him but still I got the shots from so I found out that there's a guy right behind that car too far away so I didn't Taking take any much time and just pursue, but this another guy surprised me from the fence and just killed him fast and just flanked and killed him with the one HP. Done. We just take the revenge because the friends of there just killed me before, so I have to take the revenge and we just meet the division agent again. And he just told me that those other guys over there, man, you have to go over there and help these guys. They were good, really good guys. So I just rushed out to the place. By the way, I just saw so many people. I don't know what they're doing. You know, freaking whole call thing. Finally, we reached the place where there's our division dog agent told me, and we encountered that we have allies this time. We have multiple allies with our sides, and there's a lot of enemies on the opposite side. We have to clear all those enemies and secure this position. That's our mission right now. So just just go. And once we kill two guys, they just said that. More horses are approaching, boys. You have to, you have to be careful because they have nerds, they have guns. You know, I have guns too, man. And there is too many people are coming over there. And one guy decided to go over there. I don't know why these people always hide when you see people. And these guys are so stupid that they know that I was here and they just tried to hide right next to me to kill me easily. But they didn't know that I was a division agent. I can take them anywhere out of any place. So I just completed that mission and just. On the way back to the place, and as again encountered these douchebags on the way, they just or maybe killed those guy, or maybe a guy just died to the property and this plague and just trying to rob him. I don't know what's happening. And there's another guys are trying to fight on the hey. place and just point a gun. They just leave. We don't know how to fight, man. We are, we are, we are leaving. Bye bye. Just move on. And so huge rags, Christmas decorations, all those things are happy. Again, these people are all over the place, man. These guys are little, little knuckleheads. Because they are all over the place trying to rob people. And I have to kill those guys. You know, so disgusting. But I love it. Because I get a lot of loot and I get a little real satisfaction by shooting these guys. And again, I come to the dark alley of the blood. Sorry, called blooded bullshit people and I try to pursue and find those guys who killed me in the afterlife sorry not afterlife uh, killed me in the last life and I found that and I killed I, I just tried I, I just took down one but I realized that it's a bad idea because he has a lot more friends than the last time and he tried to nade me with a freaking gas smog and I just escaped so we have three more targets over here so let's go cover up and I blew up him blew up his head off there's two more guys and I didn't want to show them my face so I just tried to shoot the gun 
just made little gun out and I just kill one more guy and there's more people are coming and here's a freaking freaking you know freaking SMG kind of a pistol and just kill me again I defeat I was defeated bye bye see you later if you like the video don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and also live streams bye bye I'll see you in the next video guys